Hey everybody, this is Donna with Johnny's Used Cars. Today I'm showing this 2006 Subaru Legacy B4 five-speed manual that just came in. This guy has just over 108,000 kilometers on it, which is about 67,000 miles. Uh, I'd like to first tell you, let you know that we do have on a lot discounts. So the price you see on the website will not be the final price, okay, when you get here. So definitely stop on by. All right, so um, let's go ahead and take a look around. We'll show the features inside, but first I'd like to ask you to please watch the video until the end. I do go over a lot of information in my videos going to answer a lot of your questions. So things like the JCI, the warranty, the uh, Rotax, I cover all that and more. So please bear with me until the end, you'll have all the answers. If not, go on and uh, contact me or stop on by. This uh, Subaru Legacy B4 is a 5 passenger vehicle in the 300 series category, so the larger category. Rotax per year is going to be uh, uh, 19,000 yen, which is about $160 right now with the current exchange rate. Rotax is due every April, May time frame. So we'll take care of it for you this year. You won't have to worry about it until next. Now you do have two options to pay for this. First one being US dollars cash outright, uh, which could get you a larger discount, or you can take advantage of zero percent finance of 24 months with zero down. Yes, we don't have a down payment requirement, but if you want to put something down to reduce your overall monthly payments, you can. Uh, a lot of our customers do like 500 to 1,000. A lot, uh, some people do even more. Okay, so this doesn't have the traditional rain guard like most because it doesn't have a, a window frame. Okay, uh, the steel frame. Okay. But always get yourself a good windshield visor as well. All right, so like I said, it's just coming in, so let's jump on in. It's gonna be a little dirty and hot. All right, so uh, for the manual uh, transmissions over here, I'm not sure what it is in the States. You're, the clutch has to be all the way down in order to start it, okay? So if the clutch is not down, it's not gonna start. All right, so let's go in here. Let me close this just for a second. 108,138 on the odometer. Showed a couple of warning lights. Try to squeeze this thing in there. All right, all the way to the top left. Uh, the top one is obviously your seatbelt one. Make sure you wear your seatbelts. They do give tickets on and off base. The one to the bottom left of that is your emergency brake. It's not a low pressure tire gauge. I know it looks similar, but it's a hand brake. So when you disengage, it goes away. Engage, it comes right back on. Other than that, just a very simple, straightforward, straight ahead instrument cluster. Everything pops up on the dash. While you're driving, please pull over, find out what it is, take the necessary action, okay? Off to the left here, I'm gonna. Let me load this so you're not getting all that wind noise. On the left here, you do have a little compartment here for some storage. Uh, then you have uh, a little display. It's going to show you outside temperature, and which I don't think it's outside temperature uh, 38. Um, and the time. You got your radio, air conditioning uh, controls, ashtray lighter, uh, the shifter, the handbrake, and two cup holders. And then you got a little console here slash armrest with an extra power outlet right there. Okay. Off to the left here, you do have your... Um, glove box. I'm going to keep this out here. I'll explain to you in a second what that is. And it looks like it has an aftermarket monitor that goes up here. Okay. All right. And you have a little bit of storage on each door panel. That is your passenger space over there. You got your red roof flare hanging out. And this is the space I have on my side. I am 5'11", as everybody loves knowing. The seat is all the way back, all the way down. Um, for me, when I drive five speeds, I like being a little bit closer because I don't like my, my leg all the way extended. So I'd probably slide this up maybe uh, about two inches. Okay. Uh, what else? Let's go eye level. That's my eye level right there. Really can't see anything past the windshield wipers like on most vehicles. Go all the way back. I normally this time I showed an auction sheet uh, showing that it's a non-accident vehicle from mainland Japan. But we normally keep those inside it's been de uh, until it's been detailed. But because this just came in, I do have it. Keep it right here. And this is going to show you that this is a non-accident vehicle from mainland Japan. Now keep that in mind. A lot of dealers can't say that. We can. Non-accident. So this was graded number four overall with a C and B for the exterior interior. So it's a really, really good grade for this vehicle. Okay. And uh, once it's been detailed, it's going to go up here on the sun visor on the driver's side. But for now, i got to keep that in the glove box. All right. Then what else? Show you a couple other things before you go to the back seat. Uh, obviously, you do have your window controls and uh, door locks on the door panel. And then over here, you do have your mirror controls, uh, retractable uh, mirrors as well. Please don't forget on the floor here, you do have your trunk release and your gas cover release that right there. And then you have a little compartment for some coins. And to get to the hood release, you just gotta follow this all the way back, all the way down, all the way back until you finally get to it uh, to release the hood, okay? And before I forget, I see this guy right here. This is your uh, ETC reader, electronic toll collector. It works like easy pass in the States if you're able to get the card for it for the expressway here, okay? I think that's about it. So I'm gonna keep this uh, engine running a little bit. This way I don't sweat all that much, even though it's like a sauna in every car. All right, there's your backspace. Let's uh, head on back here. Alrighty. 
So with the seat all the way back, all the way down, I'm a good two inches away from the back of the seat to my knees. Uh, each seat back does have this netting on the back. It, it, it's kind of flimsy. I'm not a big fan of this one. So just be careful what you put in there. You don't want to break it. Um, then you have your ashtray and you got some cup holders. All right, and then you do have a center console here that stays level, which I always like, center armrest. All right, let's go to the uh, trunk area here. And it is, of course, the all-wheel drive, okay? And that is your trunk space. My phone is overheating, I think, so I really can't see what I'm showing you right now. So now I'm gonna turn this off. We're gonna look at the engine compartment, and we're gonna wrap this video up. Give my phone a break. Oh, no, there it goes, now I can see it. All righty. And there you go, this is a two liter boxer engine, okay? Which will be uh, clean during the detailing process. So there you go, and this won't last long. These uh, five speeds don't last long. But uh, 2006 Subaru Legacy B4 five speed manual. Just over 108,000 kilometers on it, which again is about uh, 67,000 miles. Military price goes down to 5,200. With an additional military discount, we'll get it down to 5,000 flat. Again, please keep in mind the on the lot discount. So when you hear asking the information about on the lot discounts, we'll get you a lower price, all right? But for now, the 5,000 is going to include a two-year JCI, the one-year bumper-to-bumper full warranty, the 2022 road tax, and a 10% sales tax is already included. The only thing on top is going to be the American Insurance Requirement, whether you're going liability or full coverage, which is totally up to you, and we can assist you with that here. Talking about the warranty, I'd just like to say that, yes, we do have a one-year warranty, and there are two-year warranties out there. Uh, but they're not the best thing since sliced bread, so don't make your only decision on the warranty, okay? Stop on by, we'll tell you why. All right, uh, as always, we encourage you to shop around, go to the dealers, see what they have, and also the Lemon Lots, see what they have, but definitely stop by Johnny's Used Cars, let us show what we have and what our program's all about. We are definitely making a difference because we are different. Stop on by, we'll show you why, like we have many, many others. All right, don't forget two ways to pay for it, US dollars cash outright, or you take advantage of 0% finance for 24 months with zero down. Either way, we're good to go. So thank you very much for watching, take care, hope to see you soon.